Hi. Again, the Latin Guru. It's been ages since I haven't spoken to you. I was gonna make the same mistake. I made a video previously, uh, but obviously the sound didn't didn't come out because I have the headphones on, and obviously I miss on what I said. What's the, this video is about? Uh, it's, uh, I have a little the story. Uh, first of all, about no about changing yourself, about going from using your weakness as a, as a strength, uh, about preventing, yes, situations you don't want to be in. I tell you a little story, a English guy a, f fall in love for this home country woman, they get married. This, the, the woman is a rather a mature woman, yes, uh, close to her 60s, and you think you're not gonna find love, yes, or someone who loves you, you run. There's someone who, there is always someone, yes, and uh, well, they get married, he decides to buy a beautiful house back home, a big farm on her name. Uh, the the buy a house here and uh, he inherits a house from his parents sorry they actually didn't get married they lived together but he even though they were living together because he was previously married but he never got divorced he Done all this for this woman, even though they were no married, purchases all these properties and purchased their house on her name and his, uh, the one in here where we live. Uh, the, the lady has some mature children, obviously, if you're 60, you know what age more likely their children, her children were. Uh, she brought she the, she also already got a house and she decided to bring them to this new house where they're living. The guy kind of works hard, provides for everyone, but he kind of gets tired. The her adult children who's about who are about 30 to 36 do nothing but eat, sleep, and nothing else. Yes, no studying, no contributing at anything. Uh, so all this causes problems in the relationships till they eventually get divorced. He he is so kind, yes, naive. He says to uh, to her, well, the way we're gonna sort it out is uh, you're gonna keep the properties, but home, but in your homeland, the the farm and the house, and that's how we're gonna end up. But at the end, she says, no, that's not how it's going to work. I'm going to keep those properties because they're on my name. And you're going to give me a half of your, a, a, of, your grand, a, of your parents' inherited property. What happens, he had, he had to sell that. Because he had sent divorce, he had to give a fraction as well to the wife. So the, the, this lady and the ex-wife who he hasn't actually divorced they all get a fraction uh, what's the uh, the situation well you think you need someone to love you but that's that's uh, I, I feel you might end up in a trap if that's the you're always gonna look for someone to love you and you're gonna try to give them the best and uh, fulfill their desires and then you just forget about yourself but the only one that can make you happy is yourself this guy being naive end up 